what is going on guys welcome to this fifth video tutorial of racing game development in visual studio in this video we will spawn the enemy cars in random position every time when the enemy cars goes out of the game so first we will uh, check the location that is from 19020 means it should spawn only between 0 to 190 and for the y axis it should go we can set anywhere like this random 150 plus height of the enemy car it will spawn the enemy car above the game background and for x-axis we will set from between 0 to 190 there should be 190 do same for all three cars so it means when the car goes out of the game it will spawn the car above the game height and anywhere in the x-axis from 0 to 190 let's run it yes they are positioning randomly but you will notice that these cars are overlapping so to get rid of that we will set the one car in one side only means we will set one car for up to some point second car up to some point and third car up to some point it will start from 0 and it will go up to 50 and for 2 it will start from 100 and it will go up to 150 and same for car 3 it will start from 150 and go up to 200 or 190 ok so now it is working they are positioning at random position and yes it is cool in next video we are going to make the collision of the cars we will detect the collision and do something for game ending if you like this video hit the like button if you have any doubts and queries please comment below i will reply for you and don't forget to subscribe for more videos see you in the next video